had me in chains, like I was the origin of Darwinism, reduced to shame and shackles. I was the best mortician in town, not a blemish was left untouched. Family could open the coffin to find dear old Grandpa Joe, new and improved, sleeping peacefully with his rosy cheeks and origami hands. Anyone could tell you, good old Grandpa Joe was vacant, gone, completely empty. Death had been disguised by my own hands, in turn I guess had disguised me too. Right, Donnie? You want to explain? Did you tell us what happened that night? Did quite the number on this broad. Come on, fess up, Chief. The boys behind the glass want to go home. I'll make it easy for you. I confess to the murder of Selma Ivar on the night of October 25th. Yours truly, Donnie Weissman. Is that really necessary? Quiet. Let the man speak. I was set up. Oh. Selma knew what she was doing. What do you mean? You seen the broad framed you? Yes. For her own murder. About right. Of all the lies, Donnie. Mumbling nothing but the truth. I beg to differ, pal. You don't understand. Enlighten me. Better yet, explain this. No can do. All right, then explain this. Some wise guy. Huh. Now this! Well, I believe that's Claire. No kidding. And what are your fingerprints doing all over her body? Must have been planted. Donnie! I would have. Couldn't wait to get your hands on Selma, the way you ravaged Claire. Okay, hey, hey. Stop it. No. So Selma's smooching you in the back alley of London Fog. How'd she know what's gonna happen to her? I wasn't her only customer. What have they done to you? The dame was a looker, with locks that could make Anne Margaret seethe with envy. I'm sorry, sir. Oh, oh my. Is that... Daddy, this is, uh... We've been acquainted. Donnie, sir. My heart leaps for the romance. Get to the point, Romeo. She took me to the London Fog on sunset. A strange place, not what I was used to. Frankly, I stuck out like a cat in water. Girls like that don't get anywhere. 
Is anyone by the bar? What do you mean? <laughs> she can't work men. Saying you're an expert? Something like that. You're one mysterious gal. All the dangerous ones are. Hope you like aldentures, kid. You're considered a metagon if you eat like that. <laughs> well, you should know it's al dente, fella. Not sure you're right. <laughs> anyway, who's calling me a metagon? Italy. <laughs> well then, hook me and book me, fella. Selma, I think it's time we spoke about a few things which have come to my attention. My sure thing, sugar. I believe your mother was murdered. I know. I found large hand marks on your mother's neck. You certainly don't belong to a female, as was initially confirmed. Well, what are you suggesting? Selma, the way it looks a, a male, a human, strangled your mother. I can't be right. Seems to me like she was involved with the wrong people. But there were teeth marks on her arm. Her head was... Want to get out of here? Meet me in the alley. The smell of rain was faint, but the stench of death polluted the air. It lingered and filled my nose with regret. I had a bad feeling about summer then. A cold, damp, and unpleasant feeling that chilled my bones and left me shivering. Hiya, big boy. Summer, what's this all about? I just wanted a little privacy. Out here? Don't you want to love me? I... Of course I do, Selma. Well, then come here, big boy. What was that? Probably a coyote or something, sugar. That's a pretty big coyote. You're a pretty big baby. You can't be serious. If something happened, Donnie. Selma was found dead, organs ripped out of her body, intestines spilling out all over the place. It's not a pretty picture, Donnie. A sick freak like you. Enjoy that kind of carnage, huh, Donnie? I didn't kill her. Oh, of course. It was a coyote. Maybe. Quit joking us around, sonny. I didn't do it. <laughs> What's that? <gasps> Is that Mr. Binky? You want Mr. Binky? There you go. Just Franklin wants some juice? There you go, Frankie Frank. Why don't you take a little break and you give me a minute with the kid, huh? Be my guest. You ain't gonna get anything. Wait. Catering to a professional psychopath. Drink it all. It's 
Smoke? Nervous tech. I'm fine. Good. Now, why don't you tell me what really happened? I know you know, son. She planned it. The whole thing. How? Easy. My father wanted me dead. Now, why would he want that? I found out. About what? His. Business. You lost me, kid. I knew. Everything. The money. The girls. The deeds. The dirty. The dirty deeds. It all made sense. You're speaking in riddles, kid. Just give it to me straight. I was too close. He knew. Zama told him I was expendable. So is she. It was all part of this plan. Who? For God's sakes, what plan, Donnie? Someone's gonna spill. Had her fill a treachery. One last customer off before she was out for good. But he was too smart for her. Who? Selma's lover. He got a name? Sure. You know him quite well. Like everyone else in this miserable town. As Father has compassion on his children, so the Lord has compassion on those who 